Looks like the Aquato family circus has traveled through here all right. Yep, we had to hightail it out into the woods because you're ashamed of being an Aquato. I'll stop being ashamed of that. If you stop being ashamed of being a psychic. <laughs> oh, you're asking for it, Raspy. Frazy, it's okay. You can tell Dad now. You don't have to hide anymore. <sighs> this is your last warning. Frazy? <sighs> Ow! More where that came from. Forgive you. Mom? I mean, if little children never ran away from home, where would the circus get her workers, huh? Uh. What matters is that the Aquatos are all together again. And this little adventure of yours has actually given me fresh inspiration for our act. Me too! Did you see that unnatural and slightly gimmicky waterfall over there? The one flowing upside down? Stay away from it. No water. Too late, Nona. It has already watered the flower of inspiration in my heart and blossomed in two. Guess what I called it. Guess. The upside down waterfall? The devil's fire hose. Let's show our runaway how we do it, everybody. Creepy on the bottom. This would be easier if you didn't use so much hair grease. It'd be easier if your head weren't so pointy. Now, Rasputin, up top you go. Yes, son. And then you could add a little psychic flourish by levitating this pine cone. No, no. Then we pass each person up the tower like water flowing. No psychic flourishes. I told you. We. Oui. Our acrobats. We don't do parlor tricks. Uh, guys? Why not a little of both? Hops. Oh, cutting. You guys! Oh, shush. This is why we taught you how to fall as babies. <sighs> it's no use. We need the aquatodon. <laughs> I'm on it. Help him out, would you, Pooty? He's had to take on so much extra work since you abandoned your family and broke our hearts. That's a good boy. If there's one thing the Aquatos know how to do, it's making themselves at home. Anywhere. <laughs> hey, Mom. Hmm. Oh, yes, Rasputin? What you doing? I'm trying to perfect the devil's fire hose, of course. It's a risky one, but I think this might be the spectacle that puts the Aquatos back on top. Can I help? Yes. Tell me how to make the devil's fire hose reach even greater heights. How about some sight? Finish that sentence and it will kill your mother, Rasputin. Maybe if everyone stood on tippy toes? Everyone is already stretched to their full height. I should know. I stretch them every day. What if we incorporate animals into the act? Overall, children are cheaper and slightly cleaner. What if we set everyone's costumes on fire? Very exciting. But these are the only costumes we have, Rasputin. Seems like doing the trick horizontally would be safer. Safety doesn't fill seats, Rasputin. What if everyone were singing? Ugh, I'd rather die in water. Blindfolds? We tried that before. Remember the big pink eye epidemic? Shut us down for a week. Chainsaws? Who will pay for the gasoline, darling? Well, that's all the ideas I got. Sorry. Hmm. You really want to help me? Go find your brother, Queepy. He's wandered off again. 
top of what? Top of the acrobatic world, Rasputin. As the Aquatos once were. Before the curse. Can I ask you about the curse? Not too loud. You know your father doesn't like to talk about it. But as you know, a cruel fortune teller cursed our family, Raz. Every Aquato for all time is cursed to die in water. That is why we had to leave our grand aquatic circus behind and start again at the bottom in this humble family troop. We may not have water anymore, but we still have the most important thing, right? We still have... Highly family. stretchable ligaments! Oh, yes, and family. Who cursed us? Too many questions! Stay away from the water! That's all you need to know. I stopped arguing with that woman long ago. You know, Agent Foresight is a very important psychonaut. And she's really cool, actually. I think you'd really like each other if you hung out. The woman in the suit? Ugh, we get along just fine. As long as we keep our distance, a circus can only have one prima donna. Sorry about running it's okay, away. It's okay, Rasputin. I blame myself. Really? Why? I forgot to latch your door that night. You... you latch our door at night? From the outside? Only since Queepy started sleepwalking. Okay, I'm going to go practice my acrobatics. Uh-huh. Remember... Every time you lie, it takes a day off your mother's life. Nice trick, Tala. Is Nona looking? Yes, and she looks really impressed. <laughs> Hi, Nona. Oh, hello, my sweet little turnip. Are you comfortable? Do you need anything? I'm happy as long as I'm with my family. Aren't you cold out here in the woods? Ugh, please. I'm from Grulovia. This is nothing. Do you hate psychics as much as mom? Do you mean fortune tellers? Like the Galonkios? The ones who cursed us? They are not natural. They are not trustworthy. Can I ask you about the curse? Don't go near the water. Yes, I know about that part, but... Then you know the whole thing. All you need to know. Nona, who's your favorite grandchild? It's me, right? Oh, of course, you are my favorite. My sweet little Dion. Well, I gotta go back to my spy stuff. Good boy, now don't get a big head. Haunted water wheel? Round and round it goes. What makes it go, nobody knows. Uh, it's water, dummies. Jeez, this place is really good. Creepy, there you are. Aw, oh, man, you found my private dancing place. Sorry. Too late, you ruined it. Uh, Mom's looking for you. What? There are no rules in horseshoes. Just the shoe, the stake, and your mind. JK! I think I win this. Next time you won't be so loud. I know what you did.
you! I missed on purpose. I'm picking up. Hi, son. Think I'm getting any better at this? Press harder on your temples. Really? I'm already getting a bit of a bruise there. Just keep practicing. That's it? Clear your mind. If it were any emptier, I'd pass out. Focus on the hottest thing you can think of. Okay, then. I'm thinking of your mother. Dad! We're human beings, Rasputin. You're really taking to this psychic stuff. Like, really hard. Well, I guess I'm making up for lost time. Plus, it could be a fun father and son activity for us to do together, don't you think? Uh-huh. Dad, can I ask you about where we come from? You mean, Grulovia. That's a sad story, son, but there were some glory days back in the old country. The Aquatos were part of a very prestigious national circus there. We even performed for the Tsar and his family from time to time. But then that monster Maligula ruined everything. Actually, Maligula's not ancient history. Some of her followers are trying to bring her back to life. What? The Psychonauts think one of her delusionists have infiltrated the base as a mole. Then be careful what you tell them, son. We're more connected to Maligula than you should say. What's that? What do you mean we're connected to Maligula? She comes from the Galocchio family. The family that cursed all of our family to die in water? Son, she is the Galocchio who cursed our family to die in water. And it worked. My father drowned in the Valermo Dam disaster. But my mother... Your Nona survived. She escaped Grilovia and came here to get away from the curse. What do you think of the Devil's Fire Hose? Oh, it's going to be a showstopper, I can tell. Your mother never disappoints, you know. I just wish she'd let me add a little, you know, razzle-dazzle. Oh, yes, like that. Thanks for helping out back at summer camp. Well, I could tell somehow you were in trouble. Probably because of our psychic connection. So, how is Lily? I couldn't help but notice when I was inside your mind. Dad! 
that you had some uncertainty about the status of your relationship. What's that? Just tell her how you feel, son. Tell us all how you feel, Raz. Ugh. I don't think Mom's on board with this psychic stuff. Oh, she'll get used to it. Like she did with my model train. <sighs> I'm still so sad about how that elephant sat on my whole collection. Dad, our circus doesn't have any elephants. Hmm. True. Not sure where that animal came from. I'll have to ask your mother. She's the one who saw it happen. You know who else in the family is psychic, right? Does it rhyme with Daisy? Yes, and also with Lazy. Well, if that's true, then it's for her to tell us about Sun, not you. <sighs> yeah, I guess you're right. I had that coming. I'll let you get back to practicing. Yes, yes. I think I'm almost there. <laughs> Did you see that? How could I not? It caught fire! A little. Mr. Aquato, you almost started a forest fire just then. Well, I don't know about that. I do. Ah! Hey, I found some of those scavenger. Mission critical psychonaut assets? Hand them over. <laughs> Did you see that? How could I not? It caught fire! A little. Mr. Aquato, you almost started a forest fire just then. Well, uh, I don't know about that. I do. I think this thought tuner looks dark, but I think it's cool. Ooh, getting closer. Found some thoughts. Thanks, thought tuner. Doesn't love those.
And I think it's not running right now for some reason. Kids today. It's not running right now for some reason. Ha! Ah, that ought to put a little more fun in that funicular. That pun is just one of the things I love about funiculars. <laughs> Whee! Here we go! Funicular! Okay, the funicular is slow, but I think this guy is overstating. They're not called fasting killers. Whee! Here we go! You don't want to wear something like that for too long. Yep. Come with me, Psy Challenge Marker. Hey, Frazy. I can't believe Mom forgave you so easily. Can we talk about you being psychic now? Ugh, look, Raz. I know we played all kinds of weird brain games when we were kids. But I'm not ready to break Mom and Dad's hearts like you did, okay? Why don't you stay here with me? And do what? Join the intern program. That sounds humiliating. It is, but it builds character. I think. I'll, uh, consider it. Maybe I'll check the place out for a while. If we can win over Mom, that is. How long does the family plan to stay out here? Just until the circus makes enough dough to pay for the trip home. Bye, Frazy. Later, trader. Hey, Dion. Mm-hmm. Mom told me you needed help. With what? 
Reading crystal balls? Beat it, Nostra dumbass. Looks like you need someone to release the ropes. I'll just pop up there and take care of it. Oh, really, Mr. Mental? You think you even remember how to be an acrobat? You'll see. You sure look like you could use some help. You look like you could use a tailor. You sure you're using the right knots on those support ropes? I don't know. Why don't you come a little closer so I can practice my knots on you? Look, Dion. I know you're mad about me running away. <sighs> don't flatter yourself. If you hadn't stolen Frazy's horse, we wouldn't have even noticed you were gone. Hey, I sent Sugar Cube back home as soon as I got to the train tracks. Poor little thing was exhausted. Next time you run away, instead of taking the world's smallest pony, call a cab. You'll get farther. Maybe we won't be able to find you. Don't you think it's time to get over your anti-psychic stuff? I will when it stops hurting our family. Dad's a psychic. It's a phase. Frazy's a psychic. Oh, that's a great example. Yeah, we should all be more like Frazy. Ow! You wish you could be more like me. <laughs> How long are you planning on being mad like this? Forever. Do you even realize what you've done to the Aquato name? Psychics? Fortune tellers? You let out our family's worst secret. This family has too many secrets. We'll be better off when they're all out. We'll be better off when you're out. Dion. Bye, Dion. Yep. Okay, so that creepy mind stuff did save a little time. But I still don't have to like it. Deal. And you're welcome! Seeing the old Aquato Dome again reminds me of a trick Dion taught me once. Dome. It's not big, but then again, neither were our audiences. I'm just happy that it's not made of meat. For you, side challenge marker. Ho! Oh, pine cone. Hey, Dion. Mm hmm. Bye, Dion. a lot thank you are those the acorns i asked for yes no 
No, they can't be, can they? No, because I asked for acorns that were crushed, didn't I? Didn't I, Fur Lancelot? I hate to yell at you, Fur Lancelot, but I... I... I am the crushed one. It crushes my heart to see you not doing your best. Understand? Now, do I need to show you how to crush things? No? You sure? Okay. Good boy. Now, try again. But this time, think about personal commitment and delivering excellence every day. All right? Sorry you had to see that, Raz. It's a narrow slot, but I don't think I can fit through it. Hey, Sam. Talk fast. Cakes are cooking. I have some questions about pancakes. <laughs> Start flapping, Jack. Why didn't you just go order some pancakes at the cafeteria? Agent Oleander didn't give me any money. I assumed to test my resourcefulness. What's your recipe? Just the basics, you know, eggs, milk, flour. Found most of it here, with a couple quick substitutions. What sort of substitutions? If I told you, it would compromise the perceived flavor profile. Isn't that just straight up dirt? For the umami. Weren't all the supplies here kinda old? Look, you can't take the expiration dates too seriously. They're just the food industry, protecting itself from lawsuits. And protecting us from, like, food poisoning? Psst. No one's getting sick from my pancakes. Unless one of you jerks didn't wash their hands. Eh, better late than never. Where'd you get the milk? From the goats? Oh, yeah, that would have been easier. <laughs> hey, it brought us closer, Fran. You used eggs you found here? Old eggs? No! Gross! I found some fresh ones. And you know, if you use enough syrup, you can't tell chicken from snake. Eggs is eggs. Can I have a pancake? You can have any that fall on the floor. Thanks. Where'd you learn how to make pancakes? Prison. Wait, what did I say? I meant from my mother. I'm out of pancake questions. Good, because I'm out of pancake puns. So, have you always wanted to be a psychonaut too? Uh, not really. My true dream is to be a pet therapist, because I'm really good with animals. Right, guys? Can I ask you about your family? Why? Because my last name is Bull, and because that's a famous family in the Psy community, and you want to network with me to further your Psy career? Go for it. I'm a friend of your brother's. Hmm. Your head looks remarkably unexploded. Must be the helmet. Has your brother Dogen really made someone's head explode? No, never. Wait, you mean someone who didn't deserve it? No. I mean, like, anybody. Look, nobody's nerfect. <laughs> Am I right? Can everyone in the Bull family talk to animals? Most of us can talk to them. But few of us really know how to listen to the animals. You know, for instance, I can hear you rolling your eyes, Mrs. Thatcher. What can you tell me about Compton? Mm, Gramps is nice and all, but honestly, he's a little weird. No, still too tough. Okay, I'll stop asking about your family. The bull's got nothing to hide. Unlike some of these squirrels. Relax, I'm talking about your nuts. 
You guys still hide nuts, right? You guys learn to laugh a little, okay? You'll live longer. Are you worried about Maligula? Graz, Maligula's ancient history. My grandpa killed her by triggering an elephant stampede. What? I never heard huh. about... You believe the official story, do you? What are you doing out here? Well, you know my intern mentor, Coach Morso Oleander? Uh, yeah? Well, this is the first assignment he gave me. Mission. Get me some pancakes so I can think. I think it's supposed to teach me something about the many layers of the mind. Maybe. I know the butter stands for lateral thinking. I got that much. I gotta go. Catch you on the flip side. <laughs> yes, it is funny every time. Hi, son. Think I'm getting any better at this? I'll let you get back to practicing. Yes, yes. I think I'm almost there. <laughs> Did you see that? Oh, man, that smell! You gross! What's even worse? Yes, Rasputin? Dion seems really mad at me. Oh, don't worry about him. He'll get over your betrayal of the family soon. I didn't betray the family. Listen, your father raised you all to mistrust and dislike fortune tellers. You mean psychics. Mental tricksters. And now your father has this change of heart. Suddenly everything Dion knows to be true is wrong. I'll tell you how to fix things between you. How? Help him with his chores. Go. Why did Dad raise all of us to hate psychics? Acrobats and fortune tellers have one of the great rivalries of the circus. One side uses skill and passion to bring thrills and joy to people's hearts. And the other bends spoons and curses whole families to die in water. But you say you are a psychic now. So we are all being very broad-minded. How do you feel about Dad being psychic? Every family has its secrets. The trick is to hide your shame away where no one can see it. That 
doesn't sound very healthy. It's smoking! Hey, everybody! My pine cone is... Oh, never mind. That's my thumb. Does that sound healthy to you? I am a psychic. So's dad, and so's fr- Ow! Yes, and I still love you all. But please, don't rub my nose in it, Rasputin. Okay, I'm going to go practice my acrobatics. Uh-huh. Remember, every time you lie, it takes a day off your mother's life. 